Hello, kids. Well, you've been out of school for quite a while now. As you probably know, there has been a nasty virus going around. What's a virus, you ask? A virus is a type of sickness or disease that can be easily spread from one person to another. The type of virus we're dealing with now is called COVID-19, also known as the coronavirus. This virus is dangerous because it is passed through the air and is very contagious. Doctors and scientists are doing their part to find a treatment for it. But in the meantime, there are a number of things that you can do to help protect yourself and the people around you from getting it. Here they are. First, it is always a good idea to wash your hands as much as possible. Whether there is a nasty virus going around or not, good hygiene is always important. Hygiene means wash your hands many times throughout the day, brush your teeth, and taking showers or baths. By being clean, you are making it harder for the virus to attach to your body, or even more so, you are washing off any viruses that may already be on you. When washing your hands, you should use plenty of soap. You should be soaping up a little bit past your wrist, like this. How long should you wash for? Well, you can start singing happy birthday while washing your hands. Happy birthday to you, happy birthday to you, happy birthday, happy birthday, happy birthday to you. When you've made it to the end of the song, it means that you have spent enough time washing your hands properly. Also, the doctors say that you should wash your hands every 30 to 60 minutes throughout the day. You also probably have been wearing a mask if you go anywhere. In fact, most people are. This is for both your safety and theirs. Masks make it harder for viruses to be passed along. When you do go back to school, you may need to wear masks to lessen the chance of the virus being spread to your friends, bus drivers, and teachers. You may have to wear them in the classroom and even on the school bus. But remember, this is to try and stop the virus from being passed on to other people. Another term you have probably heard lately is called social distancing. This is when the experts say that it is best to stay six feet apart from other people. This is another way to try and keep the virus from being spread around to other people. As you can see, these are just a few steps that you can take to lessen the chances of getting sick, as well as not passing a sickness on to a family member, friend, or any other person in your community. We know that you miss your friends, teachers, and bus drivers. You will see them all soon. Just practice all of the things that we talked about, and you will be doing all of the right things to help you get back into school and out playing again. Thanks for watching. Stay safe, kiddos.